Hey guys, thanks for attending this last minute. I mean, this, this is something I, I thought of just last night. I'm sitting around last night. I was like, we are doing a big MIC meetup over in Dallas next Saturday, February 16th with Cobra Trading. Yep, Cobra Trading. So those, those that don't know Cobra, they are our partner uh, broker. And so this is what we use and what we recommend our members use. Um, they're awesome. This is their Twitter. Make sure to follow their Twitter, guys. Uh, hit them up. Tell them your MIC, and you get you get great deal there. We have a special arrangement with them. Uh, they're giving our members twenty five percent off on some some of the great products they have there. Um, I call them up. Here's their information. Here you go to their Twitter page, Cobra Trading, Cobra underscore Trading. But yep, so we we planned this uh, actually a couple of months ago. So thank you, Chad, for setting everything up. Here is the information. So it's on the Cobra page. So if you go to Cobra, the Twitter, you can register here. Click on the link, and here's all the information. It's going to be in Dallas next Saturday. Uh, I guess that's Valentine's Day weekend, but... Uh, <laughs> This is the love of my life, stocks, the stock market, and MIC. So what a better way to send by Valentine's with the one I truly love right now. I'm just kidding, but, uh, but it's true though. MIC, I, I love MIC. That's my family. So, um, so the information is here. So that's not why I called you for here for the announcement. Um, the information is all here. I think it's open. Space is limited. I think there's only like 100. Maximum capacity is 150. But but I, so this is how it became, um, I thought about throwing the, the seminar there as well. So I, I went to Vietnam for a week, as you know. Uh, I met up with this great MIC guy. It's just out of the blue, man. We have members all over the world, which is great. Um, he said, hey, I'm in Vietnam too. He's, he's Australian. His name is Paul. Um, let, me, let, me, let me give him a shout out. <laughs> Oops, uh, I, I don't know his name on Twitter, but uh, it's like scalp the tree. Well, anyways, well, I met I met Paul in Vietnam, and we, you know, we 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 we, we went up to my room, uh, brought up my laptop, got some nice scotch, and started drinking and started talking. Next, you know, we're two hours deep, and I'm 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 just like mentoring him on on what I do and what the lines are. He's an MIC member, by the way. So, but you know, like, like with anything, one-on-one -on -one and in-person is so much more in depth than you can ever get uh, online. And so when I was doing last night, I, it just rung to me. It's like, dude, at these meetups, I'm there to what? Drink a beer and shake your hand and talk to you? Why not? bring my laptop and actually show you stuff. Um, so I was like, dude, so this, this might be a new format for us, man. Instead of just going there and socializing, why don't we do both? We can socialize and learn at the same time. I mean, how awesome is that? So I was like, dude, I'm, I, we might do these, what I call like pop up, you know, like the Supreme stores and all that. <laughs> and the ZZs, the shoes and stuff. They do these pop-up stores and it's, it'll be a random dude. It's going to be random all over the world. This is the first one we're going to do, it happens to be with Cobra Trading in Dallas. I'm going to bring my laptop. It's going to be like grassroots, like bootstrap this thing and just, dude, give you a free seminar, man, on how to day trade. Of course, you're not going to learn everything within two hours. That's not the point. The point is the ones that are actively trading already can benefit from it. And the ones that are new can see how the next you know, how, how it is and see they like to do it and, and see the manner in which I trade. Um, this is going to be completely free, man. Uh, we, we are not buying you drinks. We're not paying, for, you know, this is, this, is just, this is like the last minute, kind of like a bunch of good old guys coming together because I, I want to help you guys trade for real. Uh, this is not, we don't make money off this event. We actually pay a lot of money for this event. Um, it's, it's more of a, of a, I think for me, it's giving back and also awareness. And it's kind of like, it, I'm, I think of myself as a stock evangelist. 
Uh, my job is to, I think, educate people, man, on, I'll tell you how, how I started because I used to be an engineer back in the day in the dot com in Silicon Valley, California. Uh, I had stock options. I didn't know what the hell a stock was. Oh, look at all these cool stock options. I didn't know that you could become rich off of it. Man, but this is a long time ago. I mean, I mean this, is bef this was during, this is like, man, 19, like the early 2000s. So this is like 18 years ago, you know? Um, I graduated, got a bunch of stock options. I didn't know what the hell was going on. I had job offers. And these job offers, one company was telling me, Bow, you're stupid. You should work for us. You will be rich within half a year. We're going public. Uh, you're, we're at IPO, and I didn't know what the hell that shit meant. What, what, what are these pay? I just wanted the highest salary, so I was kind of stupid back then, right? Because I mean, uh, growing up on the West Coast, I didn't know anything about stocks. No one taught me stocks. Uh, I, I came from a um, like a poor, I would say, ghetto high school area. I grew up very poor, so no one even knew what a stock was. You know, a stock is a guy that. A stock is what what a guy at the supermarket does. He stocks, <laughs> he stocks the cereal boxes. He stocks the cans, you know. So I was like, well, that's the stock boy, you know. <laughs> so that's the first the first thing I know uh, when I heard the word stock, right? So, so as I grew up, I was like, dude, man, I could have became rich. So one of the companies that actually offered me a job was called Web Methods. Let's actually Google this. Right, now. This, this is on the fly stuff. I don't. You know what I do is I don't script anything. Everything I do, um, it's just a one take and it's not scripted. Like I don't have a rehearsal of this. Um, web methods. Uh, this is this. Let me see. So I was offered a job at this company pre-IPO. It IPO'd and went to three hundred dollars on the first day. It's three hundred fucking dollars, dude. It, and it held the record for the highest IPO of all time. And I was offered a job pre-IPO. The shares I was given like twenty dollars or ten dollars, something ridiculously low, and it would hit three hundred dollars, dude. I was an instant millionaire at the age of what twenty-two. If I joined, I didn't know anything about stocks. Um. You can look at it for yourself, but it, it had a bunch of these other companies I worked at, and I didn't know anything about stocks, right? And so looking back, I'm like, dude, I could retire by the time I was 24. Uh, a year later, the stock was still $100 a share. So you think about that, man. And so stock education, it, it, I mean, it's only offered for the elite. I mean, I, I grew up in poverty. I, you know, I'm an immigrant. So in, in my high school and stuff, and no one knew about this stuff. So as I grew up, I learned this. It, so it's for me, it's, it's kind of like giving back. And so visiting Vietnam and seeing all these people, they don't even know what they don't even, they don't even have this stuff. You know? So, so I, the more people I educate, I call it the pay it forward movement. And so I decided, Hey man, instead of just me going out and doing a meetup and meet and greet, why don't I, I bring my laptop and start teaching as well. How cool is that? So uh, we're doing a meetup on next Saturday, the 16th. I know this is last minute, but hey, man, it's free. <laughs> uh, this event has been sponsored by Cobra. Thank you, Cobra. Um, so you guys knew about this event, but you didn't know the fact that I'm going to bring my laptop and we're going to start teaching a seminar too, all for free, guys. <laughs> so don't, don't complain that it, it's not up to par. Of course, of course, you would not learn everything in two hours. Don't, you know, don't, don't send me these messages saying, you're, you know, like, how can you learn everything in two hours? This is not. This is free. It's an introduction. And, and dude, I'm going to be there. A bunch of the guys from MIC is going to be there. Alex will be there. Tosh will be there. Everybody will be there, dude. And so... Um, I'm going to start fielding questions. Um, you guys have any questions? Uh, there's a bunch of people that attended, so I, I want to open up to questions and just raise your hand and I can uh, open up to questions, but we're going to go there, man. It'll be fun. We'll do a meet and greet. Uh, just hang out, man. I'm, you know, you get to meet me. I don't know why you want to meet me, but <laughs> if you want to meet me, you can meet me. Uh, but just dude, this is a free I, I just think it's very cool. I'm going to start doing a lot of these, man, instead of just me going there and drinking for no reason, shaking your hand. I'm going to shake your hand, drink, and teach. So I'm going to open up to some questions.
Oh, cool. We have no questions. That's even better. <laughs> I, oh, will I record it? Of course, I will record it. We're going to record whatever we do. We're going to, let's see how it goes, man. I think I can teach you how to get started trading stocks within two hours. And not just a simplified uh, buy, 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 dump, dump, dump. I'm going to teach the lines. I'm going to, this is a, I'm going to try to figure out how we can do this in two hours. Uh, thank you, Paul, over in Australia for visiting uh, Vietnam. And I actually did with him. That's why it gave me the idea. It was so much fun, man. I was sitting there. And like, at the end, it's like, dude, all it took was two hours. Uh, we covered strategies. We covered uh, technical analysis. We, we covered the process. I mean, this is stuff that people are selling DVDs for, for like thousands and thousands of dollars, guys. And um, if you come to the meetup, all right, that's it. That's easy, huh? <laughs> okay, wait, Jim. Jim is raising his hand. I'm not the phone. What's up, buddy? Jim's Sarley's. Nope. Hey, Jim. Nope. We're going to record this and uh, we'll see how it goes, guys. Cool. That's it, guys. That's a simple. There's nothing to record for this. <laughs> uh, you guys want to ask any questions about trading since I'm here? I'm, I will open the questions for 30 minutes, man. If, if, uh, this is a, since you guys came all the way here to listen to stuff, but can you talk about what will be covered in the one-on-ones? Uh, what one-on-ones? I'm going to be there with hundreds of people. <laughs> I don't know about one-on-one. -on -one. I'm going to give a seminar and uh, whoever can catch me, catch me on the question, I guess. Uh, the, but there's, it, it'd be impossible for me to go one-on-one -on -one for hundreds of people. But uh, but we'll do this, dude. This is this is what we do. Um, I forgot about this. We're picking a bunch of people to go dinner too. So an all expense paid dinner, and then uh, that's pretty much like one on one. I might even do a breakout session with uh, twenty lucky people that once you know that show up. So if you show up, um, we you know this will be MIC guys will get it first, obviously. Um, you know you show up there. This is an MIC event, so but we are opening up to other people that want to come. Um, but this is sponsored by Cobra. Uh, we'll see what happens, man. This is all work in progress, guys. I just wake up and decide to do this and do it for free. So you can't really complain about what <laughs> what should it do or not do, right? No one does this. No one in the industry does this. If they do it, they'll charge you. We are doing this completely free, and we're doing this often now. We're going to do this very often. And we're going to do a pop-up, a bunch of different cities. The next city after Dallas is going to be Miami, South Beach, Miami, guys. Get excited for that. Um, I like this kind of format, man. It, it makes it less stressful. We just going to show up with my laptop and just start chilling, man. This is the way it is, right? This is like, you know, we're not running like a big business like this. Is this if we were, we'd be charging, but we're not. So we, we might be the most stupid businessmen in the world. <laughs> the most stupid. <laughs> um, any questions on this? For the MIC, always the space for you guys. If you are MIC, you are in, man. I take care of my family. When you come to Europe, I'm coming to Europe the end of February over in Paris and London, guys, <laughs> for a personal vacation. But I will, I will meet with whoever is MIC. Um, I don't have time to meet up with every single person. But for MIC guys, that's over in Paris area or London in of February, the last week of February. I might be, uh, so hit me up if you're MIC, man, and, and you're down there in Paris. Oh, this is over in France and London, yeah. Personal vacation over there. 
but you know me, man. Everywhere I go, there's going to be people um, around the world. And I, I like to meet people and help people. So, Cool, guys. That was great. That was, uh, <laughs> I hope you're doing good. Uh, you guys are doing well on the trading part today. We, we did. Let me show you some trades since so you guys are around. Let's, let's do some quick. Uh, which one should we be? Uh, H-Y-R-E. This is a good one to review. All right, guys, H Y R E. So what happened was this: in the morning, when it popped up to five something, um, this was a weird stock. This was based upon some earnings, right? And it's not really my niche; it's earnings. So I had to dig into the filings and understand the company. I don't know if the company's profitable. I don't know what the EPS is. So I played it really safe. But there's still enough meat in this to make nice money, guys. Okay, so I'll tell you how I traded this. Of course, there'd be people trading much better, but that's but this is how I trade it, and this is the safest way you can trade it. On the way up, as you notice, this is all front side. I don't know what the hell is going on. I don't know how long it is, short it. So if I don't know, I'm staying out. I'm waiting for the chart to develop. Once the chart develops, then I can make assumptions of what you do. So at 8:30, it reached the top 560. So when it dropped down here. What it is, I was waiting for the top again to short, but it never came up. It did another stair step down. Then I waited for this bounce to short. But it was still too early. And I was like, dude, it's low volume. It's just weird. I just don't know. So, so when it started dropping, I was like, of course, I had FOMO. I was like, oh, my God, dude, I knew it. You know, you go through these, uh, I call it a, a guru, hindsight guru, right? And so I was like, dude. Oh, man, I missed it. So instead of me chasing it, I waited. I waited for the chart to form, and then when it and I'm like hoping it bounces back. I'm I'm like, please bounce back to the 5:30 line. Please bounce back to the 5:40 line. But all it made up to was the so I was scaling in. So the best I could do was this. I mean, this was safe. Basically, the chart completely broke down. There's a bunch of bag holders, and there's so much resistance. So I was waiting for the first resistance line to hit, and I scaled in a bunch here. Then I covered it all the way down. But that was it. I mean, it's it made 50 cents, but I mean, these add up, man. You know what I'm saying? These add up. So, I mean, just those type of plays. Um, I'm, I'm kind of, I don't want to go through everything since this is meant to be a, the Dallas meetup. I just want to show you some plays that maybe you can learn how to do it. So, so I posted all these on Twitter, guys. Uh, this is the sort of stuff that I will go over during the Dallas uh, webinar, uh, no, I mean seminar. So we're doing this in person, man. I'm going to show you the step by step that I take to do these things. And this is and notice you don't have to be perfect to make money. Uh, the the point of trading is to make money the most the easiest way possible with the least risk. And that's the key with the least risk. Okay, it's risky on the front side to short. It's risky to enter stock that you have no clue what you're doing. I don't understand this. I don't understand it. a lot of these stocks, the stocks I, I do understand. I paint the picture and I trade around it. Uh, here was a stock that I understood, MPRX. It's a two-day on uh, MPRX. They came up with news. It was dilution. I painted the picture. They were selling shares to, to conduct the clinical. And I'm waiting all freaking day, all morning for a bounce so I can short didn't come. I didn't chase it. There was no meat left on the bone. It, it closed at 152 yesterday. And it was like eight cents, 10 cents. I was like, dude, it's not worth it. If, if an algo came, ripped it, I'm dead. So the risk reward was nothing. I was waiting all day for the 170 so I could, so I could lean into the start to start shorting, but it never, never bounced. And these are the days that, you know, if it doesn't hit your lines, you, you just don't chase. Because what's gonna happen is this, you may chase and make money and make your eight cents, 10 cents chasing, because there's no meat, right? And you're like, oh cool, I made money. Next time you're gonna chase, you can get blown out of the water. So you need to keep good habits. So just because you made money does not mean that you traded it properly, 
Okay, I think about that. So, so, so I want to leave that with you. The key takeaway is stay in focus, stay in form, be disciplined, keep good habits. Okay, repeat good habits until they become second nature, a reflex. When you do, when you look at this, ignore, walk away. There's no meat, walk away. You can make money, but there's risk. You made money today, but the next time it happens, an algo hits you, rips you up. You're dead because there's no meat, dude. You have to think about risk reward. You have to think about all this stuff, right? You have to think about resistance lines. And so just be patient. So the way I teach my guys is wait for the lines. If the lines doesn't hit, move on. There's a bunch of different stocks that you can make money on. Um, let's see what else is there. That was pretty much the main one. Um, the rest were little scalps. You know, I, I post them on Twitter, but that, that's the key point, guys. The key point is to, you know, you only need one stock, one trade to make your pay. And once again, let's take a look at the, the, the one I made the most money on today, which was the easiest one for me because I planned it, I wait for it, and I execute it. Notice I missed most of the trade. I'm not the best trader. But who knew? Is this thing going to rip up, you know? So I, I waited. I, 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 I would have missed it if it bounced up. I wouldn't care. So that's how you should get into the mode. You know, if, if it's not a perfect entry for you, why are you chasing it? Let it come to you. There's so many different places. I'd rather make the zero dollars than lose trying to force a stock that is not ready. And it came up to me. And then opened and bounced up. And that's all I need. Made my 50 cents and started shorting some more. Went down and shorted some more. I covered. Stress-free. If you do this every day and you wait for a good setup like this, you're done. This is called the backside of the move. And we will discuss this in the seminar, man. There's a concept of front side and back side. Back in the old day, I would try to anticipate and, front and short the front side and get squeezed up. I would keep adding to the loser and get squeezed up. Sure, on the way back down, I would make my money. But what if? What if the stock didn't come down that day? What if it ran up and, you know, there's a lot of these stocks that, ran, that like dries, like uh, all these stocks, uh, Tilray, that went ballistic. Uh, it would blow you and the whole company, like natural gas, would blow your entire firm out. You know, so you make money, you make money 10 times in a row, breaking your rules, being bad habit, adding to a loss. I guarantee you there will be that one time that you lose, that you keep doing this and keep adding, that will erase all of your gains and then some. Okay? And so uh, I'm going to leave it like that. I'm going to go to the YouTube. I have a ton of these videos. Uh, let me show you. So let's recap this. Dallas Meetup, go register. It's limited. First come, first serve. Re register, show up. Okay? Um, that's next Saturday. We're, we're going to be teaching all this stuff. Um, in the meantime, let's go to YouTube. Go to our My Investing Club. Bunch of videos I, I made. I'm starting a new series called the FAQs of trading. This is, this is a killer. It's, it's very short, detailed, exactly to the point. Okay. Um, for those that want to learn all the, in the beginning, we did, I did so many of these free ones, like all the ones with um, my desktop or the daily recaps. Um, now we reserve the daily recaps for our members because they're so powerful. Each daily recap is like an hour long in depth. It's basically, it's a real time DVD quality. It's better than any DVD in my opinion that you can ever buy. These DVD is so generic. It doesn't teach you shit. Okay. Here I am trading every day and showing you what I did right and what I did wrong. And once again, guys, listen to this, listen to the level up. I think this will change your life. How to level up the right way. This is a very important and how to avoid big loss and all that. Okay. So I'm going to start doing the FAQ series and uh, hit me up on Twitter. CC me. Let me know what topics you want me to talk about in the FAQs. Okay, guys. Cool, guys. I'll let you guys go. Happy lunch. And uh, we'll see you over in Dallas. I'm going to stop the screen share now.